Boomer Shines, and we have a dream of doing the Great American Loop with ourselves, our two little kiddos, and our two cats. But first, we need to do an update of where we are. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so it's September. We did not get an August update done, and we have dropped off our weekly or twice weekly VBSs. People Why? say now it, it's been a minute. It has been a minute. We have been fully and thoroughly distracted with summer, and the fact that Warner Brothers filmed the movie in our house, which was our last update, and the fact that we had, you know. Summer Stuff. fun and kids and work and school. Yeah, school. Well, but, but they're back at school. They're back at school, so now we have time to get back on VBS. Woohoo! So yeah. we're back and we're just picking things back up again. Yeah, like in, in, in a really big way. So give an insurance update real quick. So as of right now, we have had Ida come through. So there have been a number of storms, and prior to that, I know from speaking with uh, some insurance agents that. The companies out there for marine insurance have gone from this many down to this many. And so the people to write, to underwrite marine insurance on boats has dwindled and they're getting really strict. So that makes it tough to insure a boat. So what I'm trying to do for us is before we even find a boat, just find out, you know, what kind of boat we can get insured, which we I've always tried to do. messages on what we can can get insured, but now we have been officially notified yes. that we can get what insured? Uh, 54 feet for sure with just us, uh -huh. over 55 feet, oh, and uh, 1994 or newer. I thought so, it was 2000 or newer. No, that was another insurance agent. So I've spoken with a new one who I really like, who really had his act together, 40 years in the industry. He was the first one to actually say, okay, let's make a profile. Let's make, let's take you, let's take your driver's license, because if you're a good driver, the marine insurance is gonna see, think that you're a good boat operator. Let's look at your- um, All of our boating history. Boating history, we went all the way back, I went all the way back to being 50 years old, 15 years old, operating a 63 uh -huh. foot houseboat. Um, and so we put all that together and we made an actual profile, which no one had ever done before. And he submitted it to a number of underwriters. And they preliminarily said, yeah, based on this, we, w we did an example boat, a 52 foot, um, it was a 1994 52 foot Hatteras. Okay, so anything newer than that, mm -hmm. and for sure 54 feet and under, 54 feet to 56 feet you think is like, he said 55 feet and up, they're starting to ask for people to have captains with them. But according to this guy, he's already written his allotment of captain-based policies. I don't even know why he would have an allotment. But basically, until 2022, if we wanted a 55 foot and up with a captain, he can't write it. He can't write it because he's already written that portion of his portfolio. Okay. So long story short, insurance remains elusive and mysterious, but we still don't have our actual boat, so it's But, you know, I think more important than the boat is find out, and we've always said this, find out what you can get insured for, and then go look at your boat. Don't go find your boat and make an offer, and hey, we've got a boat, oh shoot, we need insurance. Because then you're gonna be unwinding but, but, something. But we may or may not have an offer in on a boat. We may or may not. Anyway, it's a long shot. There's a lot of variables, Very including long the shot. fact that it is not under 54 feet. Well, and let's look at the fact that and we're still in boats are few and far between. Any boat that's out there right now or has been out there is kind of not really a boat that anybody wants. So when a new boat pops up, like you got to be ready to pounce and make an offer. And they want an offer like right now. Prices are, are not going crazy, but what's happening is offers are just coming in because everybody's waiting like we're ready for a boat. So ready we for a put boat. an offer in on a boat sight unseen the day it was listed. So there's a lot of contingencies and, and there were three or four other they offers. haven't accepted the offer. So basically this is our first time putting an offer on a boat. It's getting us used to this process. We're looking at it as a learning curve because this boat is not in an ideal location. It, I don't want to buy a boat right now. Ideally, we would close on our boat in December or January. So, anyway, that's our update. That's the update. Anything else? Uh, We're going to get back to two VBSs a week because we still need to keep... We've got, I've got like 
30 boats that I want to review still. So those are coming up. And one of them may or may not be the boat that we put an offer in on. May or may not. Who knows? Um, yeah. So recap. There are no boats out there. Insurance is Insurance is tough. Ever. Uh, fuel prices are pretty bad too. <laughs> so, but we're still on track for hopefully departing in March of 2022. So. Yeah, the world has just kind of. The sent world it. is a mess. The world's a mess, but it's kind of almost solidified the fact the fact that Anna, and I turned 50 in how many days? Like midlife crisis. Like we are doing the loop. Anyway, that's our our august update in september love all the comments we're really behind on everything um so if we haven't re responded to your comments we still love the comments and every now and then comments will pop up on my computer like you've gotten a comment from someone and, and then, then i go to respond it. and it's gone yeah so if you've commented and we haven't responded it could just be that we are woefully behind on life or it could be that it's like disappeared into the YouTube and yeah. still some great comments there's a woman who they're creating an organization to find a boat to go on the Amazon right oh, somewhere doing awesome like to help rescue people stuff. and so they're cool. using our reviews to try and find a boat because some our size and for the doctors on the boat or something anyway so cool. this what we've done here is helping someone create a business or a venture to go help people on the Amazon. So that's pretty cool. So that is, that, that is very cool. So um, I'm guessing the next month we'll have a bunch more VBSs and then eventually we're gonna need to transition into like getting the videos, house ready. Videos about what we have to do to get this. But first we gotta get the boat. So that's where we are. September well, 2021, T minus how many months and counting? Four months, five months. Till we have a boat. Yep. Anyway, we're back. Thanks for joining in. Come along for the ride again. Shine on!